everyone, and welcome. Welcome to Melissa with the stock swoosh.com. I am here today to review a play. This is an AFA. This is the play of the day for today, July 29th. I'm going into the end of the month here this week, and a really nice, beautiful move in this stock today. Perfect uh, entry, actually had a perfect exit. Does not happen all the time that you get uh, a perfect exit in something, but today I did in this, and actually, We'll go over this here. It looks like it did have an afternoon play as well. So here was the AFOP this morning. Rallied up, okay? Set up very nicely in here. Entry in here was 14.02. Stock dropped and fell off a cliff. Beautiful, beautiful trade. Target today really was 13 and it got there. Uh, 12.50 was the next number. And I, and I actually thought this had real potential to get to 12.50 today. It set up so nicely, so well. You could have watched this in the afternoon. This is the 15-minute chart. And you actually could have shorted this in the afternoon on the 15-minute. It broke down and went down and tried to fall uh, and break the low into the close. Just ran out of day. I mean, basically, this just completely 100% ran out of day. Uh, but I really think this has the potential to go lower, not just on the daily chart, but actually even tomorrow. I, I wouldn't be surprised if this falls and drops tomorrow or actually even gaps down tomorrow. So, beautiful trade in this AFOP today. Really like the gap, did it. Uh, didn't do anything wrong, and uh, I love this. And when I got up this morning and looked at this, I even said in the trading room, I said, there's no chance of failure on this. The 100% conviction is definitely going to work. When you know how to read trends and charts, you can tell when something is going to be a long or a short. And the one thing about this, oh, let me go back to the beginning here in the one minute. Hold on. Over here. When this set up early, it did have a rally in here. However, and, and this in here, here when this did this right in here, this is the initial open into the rally. It did have a rally in here, but it was fine. It wasn't doing anything wrong by doing this at all. Uh, this did not have an extreme amount of volume into it in the pre-market either. It was a fine amount. It was a good amount. Uh, anyways, this was one of these ones where if you didn't stick with it, if you didn't hold it, because it took a little while to break down here. Even in here, do you see here where this retested in here where people may have actually killed this or thought it was a buy or tried to do something here that was uh, bullish or gave up on the short? It didn't fail. I mean, it didn't fail. This is where conviction really, really helps you. It really helps you to stick with the trade, helps you to stay with it. You take the trade, you put the stop in the right place and just follow it all the way down. Uh, this is an, just an incredible move. A dollar here in the stock. 100% conviction, worked beautifully, a great short here. It's only Tuesday, weeks off to a good start, and uh, lots of things to do. It's earnings season, all the whole month of August. People talk about not trading in the summer. You know, July and August can be fantastic months because of third quarter earnings season and the strategy that I trade, which is gaps. And then after that, it's the fall trading season. And September and October and November are active times in the market when a lot of people are trading. Gap traders, everybody's trading. Weather starts to get chilly, and people are back in their houses and trading and, and looking to be active in the market uh, to close out and finish out the year. So really nice gap in AFOP today. 100% conviction stuck with it. And if you gave up on it or lost conviction because the way it looked like it was making the scoop here, then you missed out on a great trade. Moved a dollar, fantastic move, uh, had a great exit on this here. And again, it could have gone down to a bigger number. It didn't, but it has the potential to do it, not just the daily chart, but even, even tomorrow. Even tomorrow. So the next number is 1250 in this. You can watch it. And we'll just look at the daily chart here at the AFOP. Uh, swing trade, longer term target on this, you know, really is down here around 11 something. I, this could get here rather quickly too. I mean, this, is, this could get here rather quickly as well. So this is a really nice gelding gap. How did I know this was a good gap today? I got up in the morning and I rated the gap and I rated the gap and knew that it was a good gap. It rated over 20 points per my 26 point rating system. So I watched the stock to short on the day. I have a method that I use to rate gaps. 
when I decide I'm taking a trade, I am not guessing. I am making a prediction. I'm predicting that the stock is going to do this. What helps me make the correct prediction, the rating system, the 26-point golden gap rating system helps me predict what the stock is going to do in the day. If it doesn't ring well, then my prediction is it's not going to work right on the day, and therefore then I don't trade it. I trade the ones that predict down per the rating system to work correctly in the direction of the gap which in this case an AFOP was a short. People that trade the market lots of times are guessing. They're guessing. They're doing, they're buying double bottoms or shorting double tops. They're guessing on a trend change. They're guessing what a trend is. They're guessing a new trend is setting up. They're guessing things all over the place. I don't guess. I'm predicting. I'm predicting based on a reason and a strategy and a strategic method that I use, which is a 26-point rating system to decide to choose to trade this on the day and other stocks that I trade. So AFOP was a great trade today. Anyone that's interested in signing up for the next GAP class, it's in August. It's in August. The August class will be August 9th and 10th. I'm doing a special bonus day, which would be Monday, August 11th. The bonus day is the 11th, three days uh, that I'm doing. Saturday and Sunday is the class, and then Monday will be live trading. In the afternoon, we're going to do Golden Gap ratings. So it's going to be a terrific class if you've been wanting to do the class uh, August is a good time to do it because I'm doing that special bonus third day in the class, which uh, is going to help people get ingrained with the live trading. They're reviewing the ratings on the live day. So fantastic APOP here. Anyone interested in signing up for the Golden Gap class, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Thanks, everybody. I have a fantastic week.